everyone welcome back to our channel room with Romy and Dom. today's video is going to be <laughs> why are we always laughing <laughs> it never fails y'all it <laughs> never fails so for today's video Dom and I actually are going out of town we're going to a city called Yang Yang which is near Sokcho and we are going to celebrate our anniversary this weekend yay <laughs> actually in case y'all don't know our anniversary is on july 1st but we decided to celebrate two weeks earlier because rain season is coming it's already racist yeah monsoon season is arriving and we didn't want to celebrate our anniversary with bad weather and also we're going to the beach to do something very special today we're going to catch clams what is that honey catching the clams yeah <laughs> so i'm not really a beach person y'all like as far as like doing actual activities at the beach my idea of a beach date is going to lay down in the sand and just you know frolicking in the water however my husband is very adventurous and while he was living in australia new zealand he would always go and catch crawfish and do um free diving and a whole bunch of water activities he's definitely a water sport man so he just wants to teach me how to do it so i thought why not it's an adventure so you don't even well. know you don't even know how to wear the goggles yeah y'all i didn't even know how to <laughs> wear the goggles and hold on let me show y'all these goggles so it's not like regular goggles you wear at the swimming pool it's these type of snorkeling goggles and then he's like, I was like, I can't breathe in this. And he's like, you're not supposed to. You're supposed to breathe with your mouth. And I'm like, what the hell? So that was kind of weird to me. And also we have this little snorkeling thing too. So it's going to be an adventure, y'all. So y'all going to be right along with us. <laughs> um, and I just also want to say that uh, as far as my dad goes, he had his hearing last week. And he's just waiting on the judge's decision so him and the other employees are waiting on the judge's decision so please pray hard for my dad um and praying that everything goes well for him soon we're praying that we have good news soon but in the meantime uh yeah we're gonna celebrate and i'm going to learn how to catch clams with my husband for the first time so if y'all want to see us do that stay tuned <laughs> nook table here where we can sit and eat you got the little deck decor here the patio decor <laughs> look at this <laughs> so dirty uh, what the fuck is that i don't know <laughs> this is your country honey this is korea <laughs> i'm not surprised by anything i see here you know you got a little rope spray for them bugs or whatever so yeah we just make the most of what we got and we have a fan that's nice. And we have a little mirror here, a little vanity mirror. Very nice. <laughs> oh God, Dom's OCD's jumping out right now. <laughs> what did you say, honey? It's not clean at all. Yeah. Oh God. Oh my God. We have to clean the dishes when we come home. Uh, we have to clean everything when we get back. We're only here for one night. It's okay. It's not a big deal. What the hell is that pink shit? It's a oh, vanity man. mirror. <laughs> what the hell? It's okay. And then look at the the, the electric lines. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. And then guess what? Yeah. How much is this this room? How much did it cost? Oh, the air con? We can, we can. Mm -hmm. It's one hundred. We paid a hundred for this room. Yeah. Why did we pay so much? For well, government to pay half. Oh yeah, because we got a special deal, that's why. 
uh, Dom's job basically has a program where you put in half and they put in the remaining half or another half. So then basically we didn't really, we, we only paid like half of the amount for this room. But I didn't know it cost $100 to stay here. Okay, uh, all right. <laughs> we'll just make the most out of it. So we paid the, we, it's okay, yeah. That's okay, we're gonna go to the beach, we're gonna have fun, let's go get some clams. Yeah. Yeah. So right now, Dom yeah. is putting our food in the fridge and we're gonna have a barbecue tonight, right? So. Yeah, so we have some lettuce here. And we have more lettuce. more lettuce here. And, and we have our mushrooms. Mushroom. And then what else do we have? Oh yeah. We have some pork right here. Um here. And we have some more meat here. And then we got this on sale. We were so excited. It's marinated meat. Marinated meat. Yeah, and it was originally like 36000 but now we bought it half off for 18000 which was a good deal. Yeah. And it's so your ice cream. And then I have ice cream here. <laughs> and garlic. You can't have a meal in Korea without garlic. All right. So. Simple shit. Yeah. That's all. That's it? Okay, so we're going to go catch some clams. Yes. And then, after that, we'll come back and have our barbecue. Dom wants to show our ice bag. Boom! So cool. So yeah. cool. <laughs> they gave us these stickers. These so stickers can... came inside of the of the ice box. So I just put the stickers on it just Man, to make this it is look. An apple here. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dom Dom also gave me his apple stickers yeah, yeah. <laughs> and his beat stickers from his um earphones. <laughs> yeah. So. Anyway. So we're beach ready, y'all. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. We have to walk for 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Yeah. yeah. So. Not big deal, right? Not really. And y'all will just see the scenery while we're walking. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's hot today. It is hot AF today. It's very hot. Very, very hot. But it's okay. It's not that hot. I mean, it's hot, but it's not unbearably hot. Yeah. But it will be soon, y'all. So, yeah. Yes. All right. See you guys at the beach! your scuba gear okay let me, let me explain yes please explain it so hold on you gotta talk in the mic because of the water like, basically you can't breathe with the nose because uh -huh. it's all blocked and if you're gonna try to breathe it's gonna foggy here like like this can you see uh -huh. it's foggy 
so you have to raise the bows. Then you hold this one, right? Uh -huh. If you get it there, is the water is here? Yeah, you can breathe anytime because it's air, air, air line is over there. Uh -huh. But if you dive, water is gonna come now, right? Uh -huh. Then you gotta drink to the water, right? Yeah. So you have to find a way. Uh -huh. Breathe it, hold it, dive. Uh -huh. You get out, poo, and the water is going up. Okay. Can you understand? Yeah. And then, how are we gonna get the clams? We have to show them the process. So oh. we're gonna go in the water and then do what? Simple. Look at me. Uh -huh. You're gonna get in there. Yeah, in, in there. there. Yeah. And then walk. Uh huh. Do like this. Okay. <laughs> then catch it. And then catch the clams. Okay. <laughs> Simple. Is it too cold? Yes. Okay. This is crazy. Okay. <laughs> yeah. What happened? It's what? Too many rocks? So we have to go on that side then? Same? Okay. So what are we gonna do? Huh? Snorkeling? I can only go that far. I can't go further than that. Okay. Be careful, please. Okay, I got used to the water now. Oh my god, it's cold. It's still cold though. Alright y'all, so Dom is behind me in the water right now. So I got to put my gear on and go join him, but y'all the water is so cold right now um, and I'm trying to find a way to ease myself in so I'm going to take off my t-shirt because I do have a bathing suit underneath and I will put my goggles on and my, uh, my gear. So far Dom hasn't caught any clams, he said there are no clams on the beach, yeah so that's a sad turn of events. Alright y'all, so this is what I look like with my gear on and I'm about to hop in the water right now. I'm so close to the kids and the glow It's hard not to chase the zeros Dangled in front of your nose That's just the way that it goes In the games we play It's all about the X's and O's But down here by the water None of that matters All of those worries What do you got, what do you got here? What would you I catch? This? This? But this is clam Yeah ba baby, baby I think that's a snail Baby of a baby clam Yeah, and then? <laughs> and snail? Yeah. yeah, it is a snail and Or a hermit, I don't know, y'all tell us in the description yeah. box It's, it's fine Y'all tell us in the comments, my bad oh, yeah. These guys stuck on my skin. Yeah. They are moving here. Oh wow! <laughs> what the heck? So we're gonna we're gonna put oh, them back. These guys moving. Yeah. These guys moving. We're gonna send them back in the ocean. How did you enjoy? Ah, today was great. I actually had so much fun in the water. Um, it was my first time, I guess, snorkeling, and I loved it. It was nice. It's not snorkeling. I mean, that's why I put snorkeling like this. <laughs> Because technically we weren't deep or anything like that, but I would love to come back and do this. But I also kind of want to snorkel for real, for real now because I actually enjoyed the water. Dom was complaining the whole time because he was he was really cold, 
and he couldn't really handle the temperature and the salt saltiness of the water but i actually really loved it so i don't know y'all i might turn into a beach person like, <laughs> i didn't realize like today made me really realize that i really miss the beach because i grew up in fort lauderdale if i don't know if many of you know but i grew up in fort lauderdale florida so i lived my whole life near a beach practically growing up and we used to always go to the beach with my family and stuff but i haven't gone to a real beach in a long long time as far as like swimming and doing all this stuff so kind of got the love for it again i guess yeah. so yeah i'm definitely feeling this beach life so yeah i'm gonna definitely try it again soon when it's warmer because dawn was really cold today so yeah. let's try it again in august maybe after raining season yeah, yeah so like august september we can come back and yeah we we'll definitely gonna part come two. yeah yeah, yeah. But at another beach because this beach didn't not, have any clouds. Not this beach. Not this, not this beach. beach. We'll go to another beach. Yeah, yeah. They float away. Oh yeah. Looks good. <laughs> Mr. Grill Man. This is the food that we have here. I think this For is not now. a good idea, honey. <laughs> not a good idea for the onions, right? Yeah, I was wondering why we were putting the onions on the grill. Okay. Yeah. It's actually time to eat. Okay, so we're gonna start eating now. And then this is just the first meat that we've grilled. We have two more. Yeah, so we have a lot of food today. Start. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me see. It's cooked very well. Mm. Yum. It's good? Mm. Yum. Oh. <laughs> Are you okay, honey? <laughs> This is a, this is the first and last time. He says that every time, y'all. <laughs> every time we do any type of activity that involves grilling, he doesn't like to do I'm it. I'm really not going to do this anymore. Let's see your pores, your face sweat. <laughs> I'm really tired right now. And I know y'all probably saying, why isn't Romy helping him? Because he never lets me help him. What? Yeah, because I said the smell is coming again. <laughs> Yo, there's a cow. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear it. <laughs> and it's been making noise and doing some type of smells. <laughs> um, anyway, back to the topic. Honey, I offered to help you. You said no, you're gonna grill alone. Because you're too slow, damn ass shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that slow. <laughs> Ah, you know what? We're gonna, how about that? We're gonna eat the really good meat outside and then we're gonna come in here. You say that every single time and then, no, before, okay, hold on. Let me explain to y'all what happened. I have to talk like this because there's a family of, with kids behind me, so I don't want to film them. Y'all, let me tell y'all what happened. So, when we reserved this pension, Dom was like, oh yeah, like, you know, I'm really gonna enjoy this pension because I get, to, ooh, because I get, ooh, okay, because I'm really gonna enjoy this pension because I get to grill and I get to make my food and we're gonna eat so much good barbecue and all these things because he can eat like a cheap meal for today. Y'all, as soon as he started grilling, he started complaining and whining, <laughs> saying, oh, the grill is too much. You never help. And I was like, yo, I'm going to help you. Like, I literally helped the first meat that we cooked because he was uh, chopping the vegetables. Then after that, he's like, oh, I'm going to take over. I said, oh, honey, are you sure you don't want me to help you? He's like, no, I'm going to grill. And then like 15 minutes later, oh, I'm sweating so hard. I'm working so hard. No one's helping me. That's what I got to deal with every single time, y'all. And then now he's saying, oh, we're not going to grill but then mind you he had said that last time we went to a restaurant every time we go to a restaurant where we have to grill food over like you know like for example like um samgyeopsal or like you know we go to a buffet remember we went to the clam buffet 
same thing he's like after this time i'm never grilling again you never helped me never ever ever and then now he's the one who offered oh yeah let's go to the pension to go grill some meat and we're gonna eat a whole bunch of food and then as soon as he got a grill i'm like honey can i help you no it's okay don't worry and then now oh you never helped me <laughs> this is my life y'all ain't that right my 50 percent 50% what? True. 50% true. Yeah, whatever. 100% true. And this cow is killing me. <laughs> this cow has been moaning since like one hour ago. And I'm dying because the cow is so loud and he smells or she smells. Oh yeah, cows are women. So she smells. Like sometimes we catch a whiff of nature while we're eating, so yeah. And then someone's doing laundry. We heard laundry noises. <laughs> it's just a funny. It's been a funny experience, y'all. We couldn't film everything, but it's been a funny time. <sighs> I thought you said we we're gonna grill the rest tomorrow. I'm gonna try one more. Thing. Okay. Just, just in case. Okay. Camera, I want to see how it tastes. This is the marinated beef. Mm. Good? It's delicious? Mm. Good morning, everyone. So, it is the next day and we are making breakfast. Are you tired? I'm already. Wait, hold on. Let's see. Actually, it's good. It looks good. Yeah, it's the leftover pork that we didn't eat. So, yeah. Yeah. It was actually a good idea. Sorry. Yeah, it was a good idea. We were really full yesterday. So, yeah. So, we're going to eat this so for breakfast we, with some. We ate the whole of the meat last night. Yeah. And the meat again. <laughs> exactly. Meat life. This is the meat life, y'all. <laughs> and we are going to also include some ramen in this and then that's it because we're trying to lose weight for the wedding dom has this competition so we try to limit our cheat day meals please don't misunderstand that this is my first cheat after four, three long yeah time yeah after. yeah exactly like we don't do this often actually it was just because it was a special weekend and um honey can you Tell them how I was sleeping last night. <laughs> you were explaining it earlier. You know, you just fell asleep. Even you just, just hold on. You just lie over there, like oh, this felt comfortable. <laughs> and then after two minutes, you start to snow. You like. <sighs> <laughs> I was so tired. Honey, look at me. Look at me. <sighs> <laughs> right. It's snowing, snowing, really bit further. Suddenly, like, <gasps> yo, y'all know, hold on, hold on, hold on. I was yo. thinking, like, you're gonna die soon. No, y'all know that good sleep, yo, yeah, because beach, beach the beach time <laughs> took up so, so much of my energy. So I was exhausted after we finished. You know, we went to the beach. And then, you know, we ate a lot of food and then it was the itis just kicked in. You know, after you take a shower, you just, it's a wrap. You're just ready to go. So I didn't realize I slept that hard last night, but we had a good rest. Yeah. And y'all, unfortunately, you know, uh, there are a lot of families in this little pension. So, you know, we, we just had to go to sleep if you know what I mean. <laughs> But anyway, um, this is marriage couple life, y'all. No, Hearing you know, each other you know. snore. <laughs> Hold on, let me get you on camera here. Yeah, what are you gonna say? This room, two kids. <laughs> that room, three kids. Three kids, and one of them kids was trying to speak English and stuff. I was like, bro, like. No, no, no sexual. <laughs> yeah, no sexual. <laughs> We just arrived at this place called Sokcho Pada Hangiro and street, yeah. it's just like a street where we're just gonna walk and enjoy the scenery. The beach line. So y'all we just stumbled upon Lote Resort. This is a Lote Resort in Sokcho. Look at this. 
Like we can just peek in from the outside, but look at this. The water's so crystal blue. <laughs> All right, so Tom and I are gonna try to go inside of the Lote Resort on a secret mission. But there's nothing wrong with the two I know, but you know, you never know though. We're gonna go undercover <laughs> to go undercover. inside. I'm trying to make it interesting for them, okay? We're gonna go undercover to go inside and check out the Lote Resort. And let's try to buy the water. I'm thirsty. Okay, okay, he wants to buy water. Yeah, he's been thirsty since we got here. All right, let's go inside Lote Resort and see what it looks like. Sometimes I get a little grainy shade of jealousy In truth it's how I know that you're the one for me And when you're seeing red come over we can talk it through I'll throw a warmer shade on your colder moods yeah. Drip drip in the canvas frame Let me show you, this is a kimchi jjigae mm -hmm. Kimchi jjigae mm -hmm. with the pork belly mm -hmm. Normally maximum maximum 8,000 to 10,000 one. Oh, it's 19,000 here. And it's 20. Oh, 20,000. 20, 20 so per expensive. Person. This is how long time? Normally 7,000 one. Uh -huh. Look at the price. 16,000. Well, it's a this, resort. This is, That's this why. is most of, most of cheap, cheapest, the cheapest, the, the, one of the soup. Uh -huh. You know, the soup with the lights. Normally, people buying this for 5000 one and in their local place. Look at that. At the resort, it's 16000 <laughs> But you know, everything is marked up here. That's why it's so expensive. Don't even try to buy anything. <laughs> except the water, except the water. Yeah, I think we'd have to like get, like we try, we'd have to like buy food from outside and then come, oh. come here, yeah. You, I don't think it's, I don't think it's a good idea to eat at a resort because it's going to be too expensive. It's really, it's really they also have a barbecue place where you can set up your grill. Look at these beautiful bamboo trees. Rote Resort made this one too. That's possible, yeah, because it's right behind the Lote Resort Hotel. Oh uh, yeah, here. <laughs> and then bamboo trees right here. I think they made it. Yeah. It's so neat. All right, y'all, before we sign out, I just wanted to talk about, um, you know, kind of trying different things or trying new things. This weekend, it was my first time just trying something new. And even though it was something I've never tried before, and it's something that I've never been exposed to as far as like, you know, scuba gear and all that stuff. It's just something that I thought that it like, you know, I just thought it'd be really cool to try something different. And I know that there are probably a lot of subbies that have the same type of mindset who always want to try something new. But then there are also other subbies who are maybe comfortable and like to stay in doing the same things that they do over and over again so basically um all of this to say that you know trying something new can actually open up so many opportunities and i realized that when i was in the water and i was trying it at first i was like mm, like when don first approached me about the idea of catching clams in the ocean i was just kind of like skeptical about it because i was like i'm not a beach person i'm not the type of person to go to the beach and do all of that stuff like you know water activities like usually i'm not really with it like that and it was something that was new to me so at first i was kind of like mm, i don't know if it's gonna work out but then i was like you know what let's try it let's try something different and i'm so happy that i did because i ended up enjoying it way more than he did <laughs> don was cold he was like oh it's too cold i can't see any clams in me i was just like you know in the water just like uh oh oh we're in the tunnel now hold on let me wait till we get out the tunnel overall i quite enjoyed the experience and i'm so glad that i tried something new and what do you think honey what's your tip for people who want to try something new <laughs> no, i'm tired well, you know? i'm okay you know what I'm, I'm, you are tired what did i say that's wrong i'm driving all the way to go there i set up everything about Krista. and i drive everywhere to visit in Tokyo. Even I'm driving all the way to go back okay, to the Okay, can you explain to them why you're driving? To 
because you, you are not trying your best. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, let me tell y'all, for y'all who don't know, because y'all gonna think I'm just a princess not wanting to do anything. That's yes, not that's the case. Take you no. that's, that's not the case. The case is that I don't have a driver's license in Korea, so I cannot drive here. And the thing is that I do have a driver's license from back home, but it expired, so I wasn't able to trade it in for an international driver's license in Korea. So I asked Dom a few months ago, I was like, hey, honey, maybe I should get a driver's license here. Do you want to know what he said? He said, no, I don't think it's a good idea to get it in Korea because, you know, it's all in Korean. And not only that, but um, we're not going to stay here too long, so it doesn't make any sense for you to get it. But then I was like, okay, if I do end up going, like, getting my license, because I could just go back home, get a license with you or whatever. I said, can I drive your car? He said, absolutely not. So then now, he wants to complain. Keep going, go ahead. What else, honey? Basically, mm -hmm. I didn't say that you are not supposed to get the Oh, license. now it changed. Now everything's changed. You know, the, the, the driving test is no English service. Yeah, that's fine. I can learn Korean. Oh, wow. I don't think so. Anyway, point is that Dom is just sleepy. Honey, I just want to ask your opinion though, like about trying something new. What do you think about that? That's good. That's great. New opportunity. Always good experience. Yes. I don't know what I have to say. I'm so sleepy. Can you okay, leave me alone? Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> it's good. It's good. Yeah. You're going to have a good experience. Okay, that's it. <laughs> so on that note, thank you so much for watching y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. As always, take care of your beautiful selves and bye. Bye. I'm so sorry if you're right now. Bye. <laughs>